Hey guys, welcome again to Happy Wallet Wednesdays where I am going to show you guys how I shop and plan a meal for around a dollar a serving. Now today I am at my local Asian market and I'm excited to share with you guys how I shop for fish because fish is a really good deal here. Hopefully they'll have something awesome there. Let's see what they have. So here is some, only some, of the mass amount of fish that this market has to offer. They also have um, fish that you can pick and they'll gut it for you, but everything is really reasonably priced here. So I'm going to get a pound of this cod here and it looks like it's wild caught from Mexico. So I have had this cod before and it's actually really good. This is what I'm talking about. Two for one of these bags of cauliflower, and they are big freaking bags. So I'm definitely gonna get one of these. Squash, two pounds for a dollar. It's 50 cents a pound, so I'm definitely gonna get one of these. So I'm back home, and I want to show you guys what I'm gonna do with everything that I got. We're gonna start with the cauliflower. Okay, so what I'm going to do is put some coconut oil, just smear it on this aluminum foil take the cauliflower even though i'm only gonna maybe use 25 percent of this i'm gonna put it on here i'm gonna heat my oven to 400 degrees fahrenheit and i'm gonna let the cauliflower cook about probably for about 30 to 40 minutes until it turns like golden brown and then when it turns golden brown i'm gonna take that out and i'm gonna show you guys what it looks like in the meantime, I'm going to make zucchini noodles with my spiralizer. You can find this on Amazon. And the zucchini was 50 cents a pound. This specific zucchini noodle is done, 29 cents. I just took my cauliflower out of the oven. It smells so good. They are very nutty in flavor. They're no longer uh, have a very strong cauliflower taste. And I didn't season them with anything. I just put some coconut oil on the bottom so they won't stick to the aluminum foil. And I'm probably only gonna use, like I said, uh, less than a quarter of this, maybe about 20%, just like a little bit. What I'm gonna do now is saute up the zucchini and then toss some of this cauliflower in there. Just added a little bit of coconut oil to my pan, then zucchini, just to soften it up a little bit. Gonna season it up with some Mrs. Dash and gonna add just a tiny bit of the roasted cauliflower. So I have my pound of the wild caught cod, half a lemon, and some herbs that I've used many times for several recipes. As you can see, they're very wilted. So all I'm gonna do is toss the entire fish in my food processor along with some lemon juice, along with these herbs as much as I want and blend it up and it's gonna turn into the base of my burgers. Okay, so as you can see, the they don't have to be precisely clean or anything like that. I literally just got as much of the herbs as I wanted. I got a lot. This is a great way to use your leftover herbs because as you saw, mine were definitely not fresh. They were very wilted. And yeah, so I'm just gonna let it go now. You can definitely add whatever the heck you else you want. If you want some garlic in here, you can put some soy sauce or low sodium soy sauce or whatever you want. You can even put some mustard in here. Uh, just go ahead and blend it up and you got yourself your some fish burgers. And that's it. So now what I'm gonna do is heat up a nonstick pan and cook these up and they should be four burgers because this is a pound of fish. So here we are, $1.25 for each of these fish burgers. As you can see, they're definitely not small. Here are my hands and they are pretty large. I'm just cooking them on a nonstick skillet about four minutes per side and then I'll flip them over and I'll show you guys what my finished product looks like. So my dinner ended up being $1.66. I ended up spending 29 cents on the zucchini. I used a fourth of the cauliflower, which ended up being 12 cents a serving. Uh, the fish was one twenty-five a serving. So total for my dinner was one sixty-six. We love this series, Happy Wallet Wednesdays. I love making them and I'm so excited for all the things that I'm gonna bring to you guys every Wednesday. Please make sure you like this video and subscribe and I will see you guys next time. Have a great day. Bye.